not big on chatting. All requisitions come with free cornbread. I got a nice load piled in the back. Nobody eats that. I like cornbread. What are you talking about? I love cornbread. What do you mean nobody likes them? All right, let's change the uniform. No. <sighs> nah. Yeah, that seems more logical. Ooh, which one? That helps with the loading speed. All right. the burst rifle. Apparently it's better. Alright, let's... I did say I'd bring in the flamethrower. be down but I'm not out oh cool oh finally I can add these whatever they do now let's do this I don't know what we found under LV-895, who built that place, or what it's for. The distortions and anomalies Cynthia started are still growing. Something's warming up. We need to know what. Get down there and find out. Hmm. I don't like my sidearms being disabled. Retro camp. View of the world through the lens of a low risk. <gasps> that might actually be pretty good! It's kind of like, you know, how do I put this? Old fashioned! Any of you come back with a makeup buddy, my lock stays sealed. Uh, duh? Alright, let's see how this place looks old fashioned! Duh! Uh. All right, the gift of fire advanced. Prometheus. Prometheus, Prometheus gave humanity the gift of fire. And the only gift that the engineers gave us was the gift of life. But they never gave us any gratitude. Oh, wow. You said old fashioned, you were kidding. I look 8-bit. This is so cool! The gravitational anomaly continues to intensify. Locating the source is imperative. Stay frosty. We know there's Xenos. God knows what else Cynthia had. Oh, what? Alien equipment. Who knows what it does? Be careful. Shit. An idea? Xenos don't like fire! Where? I can't. Oh, there they are. Actually, they're a bit more visible. Burn, you overgrown insect! I'll have you know that I've been eating at 
I well, actually, yeah, I, I, I ate um, crickets in my bi biology class. Um, you know, the teacher actually, I, never mind. They gave us like uh, some more. It was like a test, like uh, you know. Everyone was doing it. Believe it or not, they even gave us stickers saying, like, we ate bugs. Oh, oh I get it! Yeah, boom! Yes! What else you got? You know, I thought this wouldn't affect them because of acid blood, but fire affects everything! Secure. What are we looking at in here, Doc? Uh, it, it could be, I mean, well, that structure... <laughs> I have no idea. Of course you don't, because it's all unknown. What is it? I don't see anything! I mean, that's probably because the pixels everywhere. It's like an old-fashioned camera! Esther's readings are from the right, uh, mostly. Uh, we're heading right. Right? Curious. Hey, here come our little friends! Uh, but I'm not finished with the... Alright, fine. Wait, when does alien ship scary explosive? Oh wait, duh, what am I saying? Since all the time. Um, define big b Oh, warrior. Ah, it's a warrior! Burn, bug! Burn! Ha ha Why aren't you deterred by this? I thought Xenos didn't like fire! Endeavor just detected a burst of 511 kilo electron volt gamma rays from within the gravitic anomaly. That means... That sounds like something just turned on. I mean, Marvel science I can understand, but... Sci I mean, personally, I love sci-fi. It's always so... It always adds... I mean, this stuff... Could be possible. I mean, I just some that. theory. Of course, I don't know if any animal can withstand can withstand not living on. Uh, <sighs> Endeavor's ground penetrating radar is worthless. Places one big return. No, it could be worse. Oh, no, I know. Up top, what is. Do you have any visual? Face huggers, I wager. I wager face huggers. It sounds just like. There is an instrumentality across the room. Clear the box first. Yeah, about that. Wait a minute. Maybe it wasn't. What was that sound? Hey, hold up and listen. I will try to acquire a facility layout. Hit only the controls I specify. Grabbing ammo. So when fire team set up a perimeter, it could take her a while. Oh no. 
Oh, man. <sighs> Setting up a perimeter. Activating! Center right, center top. Analyzing output. Stand by. Things are everywhere. Stop. You don't know a game that I wish was actually a thing? Nah, actually, no, I'll save that talk to you. Is everyone okay? I believe I'm actually doing this good. No, be this may look easy, but trust me, it's oh, it's not. up the this ramp come on you android box on the bridge hose them down how about what hose him down that's what she said Yo, Honecker, anything you can tell us about who built this place? There's not one hard angle in there. Just curves. Uh, maybe a cultural preference? Oh, um, up. I wonder what would happen if one of those space huggers attached itself to an engineer. Would it be the same size as it? Signals, get a camera on. Miss them. I saw no evidence of xenomorph physiology. Maybe it's local life? Or rats. Paula Station had rats. Prowler. Prowler? Something else is in this ship. But what? I know that sound! It didn't sound like a face hugger. What was it? Probably not gonna be good. More bugs! Probably not gonna be good in you know, this 8 bit. Me. These robots can't heal me.
there is an unusual power signature nearby, similar to emissions within the anomaly. Might you set up a scanner? Deploying sentries! Scanners activated! The structure on the ceiling. Over the scanner. Later, we got company. Oh, yep. They're coming squadron by squadron. Primitive, mindless monsters. So, what's that on the ceiling? A biological energy capacitor. A living battery. What? Patching up. We're near the end of the layout Esther grabbed. Use the, uh, squishy thing in that room. The squishy thing? Uh, fine. Ammo. I'll do it. I won't like it. Farthest left, center right, center top. Stand by. Recording the output. Oh, what do you know? The androids can shoot. Robots should take minutes, even seconds. Maybe. I'm still skeptical of that sound. Oh boy. The map seems to label the section ahead Basket of the Heavenly Traveler. What? What does that- We must be missing some context. Can I see? Basket? <laughs> ah, I will admit- Oh, jeez, I'm- Bug. Don't mess with the best. I'm taking you in. What is that? Isn't it deterring them? Xenomorphs are pathologically afraid of fire! Next 
time I'll do the mission hard. Looks like a control center. No, 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 careful. That's an anthropomorphic assumption. What does that mean? Grabbing ammo. Could you obtain a LiDAR sweep of the presumed control center? That'll rile our friends in the walls. Be ready. Entry deployed. And I bet you if we turn this thing on, our friends are gonna start running all over the place. Activating Hydro Regenerator!
Probably not that much. That's a big ass door. It's not a door, it's that, a That's a ship. Right? It is the source of the gravitational distortions. Cynthia's asset zero. That's where we're headed, fire team. You want us to go in there? Well, I've always wanted to enter the engineer's ship again. Uh, we haven't forgotten about all that missing pathogen, right? No. In fact, something keeps bugging me about it. God, I yeah, it kind of makes funny. I kind of love the eight bit. Uh, see, with the, uh, demolitions expert, of course it's easy. Oh, wow. Can't believe it actually looks that good. <clears throat> anyway, we're trying to get back to where... Uh, oh, look at all these colors. Ew! I'm gonna put three bullet holes in your head! Holy crap, you scanned a GEOS data pad? I haven't seen one of those <laughs> since I signed up. They're a local brand on Gateway Station. Tower 6, level 33. They'd acquire parts from big companies, closeouts, auctions, and assemble them into gear the mega corporations would charge twice as much for. Such as? Somebody on Wayland's staff must be my neighbor. I'm from Gateway, born and raised. It's a primary orbital port for the United Americas, built in 2030. We hold geosync over Quito, Ecuador, but we're an independent territory. 30,000 permanent residents, our own rep in the UA Assembly, and our own customs laws. Somehow, I highly doubt that means our timeline. If I didn't keep the ship's stores balanced and we tried to go FTL, you know where we'd be? Hmm? Spinning and... Okay, well... Let's see what fell off the back of the power loader. What do you got to say for you? Dr. Honecker? So, Esther said I should explain the pathogen for you the genetically engineered mutagen Paula Station experimented with. Wayland yutani provided a jar of it, but never said where they got it from. They now I know it was from those ruins you found. Not just ruins. The engineers' laboratories. The animals we used pathogen on got faster, stronger, more durable, but crazy aggressive, too. The company wanted financially viable mutations. When Administrator Bellows arrived, he had pathogen tested on xenomorphs. And that's when everything went off the rails. The pathogen was genetically engineered? That was the lab's consensus theory. Genetically engineered nanobiotech. Definitely artificial. Unbelievably complex. Way beyond any technology they'd seen. Someone designed it to do what it does. Can you Someone a hell of a lot smarter than us. Can you explain how it works? Well, I'm an anthropologist, so anything I tell you I got secondhand. I may not remember it right. The team had two xenobiologists. Cruz thought pathogen unraveled the telomeres in DNA, then swapped around sections of code. And Pryor thought it activated alleles and non-coding DNA. They couldn't figure out why mutations weren't 100% consistent. It was Etienne who came up with the theory that pathogen can blend the host's DNA with that of viruses or bacteria in their body. You said it affects animals, not plants. Never. Matthews thought its ability to enter cells was blocked or inhibited by polysaccharides, cell walls, like in plant or fungal life. Animal species never have cell walls, at least none we've seen. That's been true on every planet we've surveyed. So, let me get this straight. 
You used the pathogen that was from those very same test tubes on the xenomorphs that we've just encountered? We didn't get a choice. Bellows put his own synths in charge of security. He had Xeno eggs. He could have done whatever he wanted with us. If it makes any difference, the last surviving pathogen experiment was Monica. The gray striped Xeno you killed on Katanga. I'm. I'm sorry. Can the pathogen be destroyed? We never found a way to safely dispose of it. Critters mutated by it we could kill. Pathogen itself? I don't know. The safest thing is to leave it in those jars. They're pretty tough. That's all I need to know. Sure, you gotta be busy. Anytime you wanna talk about pathogen or anything, I'll be here. Yeah. Goodbye, Doctor. <sighs> Let me just change my... So I already got my... Let's try the gunner! Technician? Doctor? That should do it. like to keep this handy for close encounters. Something tells me I need a few upgrades. You know what I do when I'm not so sure? I Double that! Something tells me I don't want to. Casual is difficult enough as it is. But trust me, when I do play extremely hard, I'll let you know. When we took out Cynthia, she triggered something. Some contingency plan by Waylon Yutani. Wait now, a minute. Gift of fire. An alien ship. That's the source of the gravity distortions. We don't know yet what Cynthia's trying to do with it. Who knows what's on that thing or what it can do. Get aboard, shut it down by any means necessary. All right. No bombs. Secure for the first. We'll be pulling six Gs in three, two, one, mark. Ooh, look at the graphics on that spaceship. 